I made some candy. Let's try her candy that she totally made. Today we're going to be trying a box of assorted candies from River Street Sweets, Savannah's Candy Kitchen. This doesn't actually come from straight from Savannah, Georgia though. While mm. we have been to this uh, establishment when we went there, my dad and my stepmom brought this back from Orlando. They, they, they also have a location there. Mm. They brought us a little, oh I should get the, hold on, it comes with a pamphlet. She got a pamphlet! A pamphlet. Okay, so let's see, what do we have, what do we have? Wait, does this even tell you what? This doesn't tell you. It doesn't tell you what's inside the box? I don't think so. But I can tell you where they're, uh, what they have locations at. Savannah, Georgia, Lancaster, Pennsylvania, The Battery, Atlanta, Key West, Florida, San Antonio, Texas, Greenville, South Carolina, Orlando, Florida, and is that one? Asbury, Asbury Park, New, New Jersey. Jersey. Yeah. Hmm. So, my dad lied to me. There, the, the, this does not tell you anything. No, it's pretty useless. <laughs> Good lord. We just have to guess. Let's take our best guess. Uh, I'm excited about these. They're candy covered. Oh. Orange slices. They melted to the bag. They're very sticky. Ooh. Look at those. Yes. I don't know about all this. Very sticky. God dang. What is that thing? It's a candy covered orange slice. So it's an actual orange slice? I think so. Can you eat the peel part, or is that yes. a real peel? Look at that! I love that color. Wait, no, this isn't. This is just the gummy. Oh. <laughs> mm, it's really what good. What Because if it was a candy-covered orange peel and I ate the back of it, I'd be eating into Hush. an orange peel. Hush. <laughs> It's really good. Very sweet though. Yeah, super sweet. This would be something Cherry. You'd to, this would be something you'd have to nibble on. It's kind of just like melts in your mouth. Mm -hmm. Like a cherry orange slice. Not bad. I don't love the texture though. The flavor is good. And I like the little crunchy pieces. Mm -hmm. But I don't like the texture. It's like a little too mushy. I wish it was more more gummy like. I'd give that like a four out of five. Mm. That's good. I'd give it like a three. And then this is chocolate covered peanut brittle. Peanut brittle. Um, ain't very brittle is it? It's sturdy. Just little peanut chunks in it. Was that caramel too? Peanut brittle. I'm not sure. I get a peanut. Yeah, it might be some kind of caramel. Ah. Crunchy. Peanut brittle. Peanut brittle is supposed to be crunchy. I don't eat peanut brittle on a regular basis. I don't know what to expect. It ain't very good. That's probably why I don't eat it. I don't really like that. Mm -mm. Mm. Flavor's a little strange. I don't. It's Crunchy. I like it. Mm. How tastes like caramel corn? I don't like caramel corn. Kettle corn? Caramel corn. Oh, what is caramel corn? Caramel covered popcorn. Oh, I don't eat that either. <laughs> I don't like that though. That's gonna be a solid 1.5. Four. What? Were you paid under the table? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. My dad worked at a deal with the Savannah Candy Company. What are these things? I'm not even sure. Yeah, a little. This looks like poop. <laughs> what is with you today? <laughs> no, it's probably chocolate covered. Well, it's salt something. on top. Probably a chocolate covered. Uh... Meatball. Meatball, yeah. <laughs> Some meatball, guys. 
I think it's gonna have to be a winner. Yeah, it's caramel. Oh yeah. It's like a sea salt caramel. Dark chocolate sea salt caramel. Mm. I wish it wasn't dark chocolate. I don't really fan of dark chocolate, but if I'm gonna eat dark chocolate, I like it to be salty too. Mm. Cause it cuts down the you don't notice the the bitter chocolate as much. Mm. I think this being a sea salt caramel dark chocolate, all the flavors work together. Yeah. Mm. It'd be good for someone who's into that. Not into anything, apparently. I mean, I can tell that it's good for someone with those types of taste buds. I'm just not a fan of... For one, I'm not a fan of salt on chocolate. I know some people like that, but I'm just not a huge fan of it. And I don't like dark chocolate. I do love caramel, though. Mm. So I can tell that this thing tastes good for some people. But for me, it's just not doing it for me. Four! Oh God, you're still drinking that. This, that 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 said tells you all you need to know about your flavor palette. Well, I don't like it, but I gotta wash it down with something. I'm not. Look at this. Pretty. And if you don't know what this is, I will put it in the cards at the end of this video, and I'll let you know. Look at this pretty thing. Ooh. It's like a big piece of chocolate with almonds in it. Let's take a bite, and I'll give you a bite. A cool little design. Mm. It's really dark. And hard to bite too. It's, it's okay. <clears throat> it's okay. Definitely the worst out of this bunch. Yeah. Because it's dark chocolate and it doesn't have anything to really cut that flavor down. And my teeth are hate hurting. What? What? The thing was hard. I bit too hard. I shouldn't have. Oh, <laughs> oh, he's so a wee bit too hot. Get out of here. Yeah, that's a solid one. I give it a one too. Probably that one before it, the salt thingy. Probably give it two. I, I give all of them four except for the last one. I give a one. Because it doesn't have much variety, not variety, I guess. It doesn't have much flavor to it. It's yeah. just dark chocolate yeah, with it's a few just almonds dark chocolate. in it. And almonds are probably my least favorite nut. I'm gonna, I'm gonna... What's your favorite nut? Peanuts. Cashews. Oh, I like peanuts. Because I love peanut butter, and you can't make peanut butter peanut without butter. peanuts. What? I hate peanut butter. You just had a peanut butter and jelly sandwich the other day. I didn't. Oh, yeah. You had peanut butter and jelly? Yeah. I didn't have a sandwich. Oh, you just had the in-betweens? Yeah, I always do that, because bread is calories. Anyway... Are we done with that? Thank you to my dad and my stepmom for picking these up for us. Yeah, it was fun to try. Mm hmm. Yeah, we need to go back to Savannah one day. Yeah, I'm down. This is making me miss River Street. Yeah. I've never been to Savannah. Highly recommend. It's my town. I own it. No, I just stole its name. So, if you're wondering what I've been drinking throughout this episode, it's the new Nitro Pepsi. If you've been wondering why I've been ragging on it the whole episode. Yeah, it's 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 interesting. So if you want to know our thoughts on this, check out the video right there. I'll leave it right there so you can go ahead and click on that if you haven't seen it. Check it out. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye.